So guys, I'm back at it again. Wow. So guys, I'm back at it again. I'm here doing a little section day hike again um, at part of the Appalachian Trail. So it's gonna be just a little small, uh, probably nine miles or 10, something like that. Um, we're gonna see pulpit rock. Um, I'll definitely put everything, all the information on the description. here on the trail now um, seems like it's gonna be a pretty decent quick little trail only nine miles nothing big or major so guys it's supposed to be raining today um, and then I guess later on it's supposed to clear up um, it was raining quite a bit driving up here so I was a little not too thrilled about it but right now the way it's raining as long as it stays like this it'll be fine and hopefully when we do get to the top there's a nice view and it's not clouded up with the clouds so we'll see so guys, right now, climbing up a little bit. It's not bad, it's good still. But, just get a little workout. Good thing, my legs are good today, so I'm not gonna be complaining about my legs this video. So just seen some some deers they ran off before I could get some footage um, the only thing right now is this rain jacket seems like not it's not raining but I don't want to put it away um, and then it starts raining again so I'm gonna wait a little longer and if it doesn't rain anymore then I'll take it off cuz right now this rain jacket it's getting me like all humid and sweaty. I treated it, but um, seems like no matter what, it's just all the raincoats I get seems to be making me a little sweaty. So if you guys know any rain jackets that are good, let me know. So guys, right now we're kind of dipping low real quick, just for a short, we're going back down a little bit, and then we're gonna shoot right up, and then we'll stay kind of like at the top, we'll go up and down, but mainly at the top. And then eventually towards the end, when we're returning back to our car, um, we'll start heading back down. It's already looking nice up here climbing up a little bit it's starting to rain quite a bit now but still so far not that bad rocky pennsylvania all these rocks <laughs> it's pretty cool though Ooh, almost fell
This is gonna be amazing. I can see it already. So, the little things you gotta kinda watch out for um, to make sure you're going the right way. It's kinda like telling you to turn this way. It's getting kinda dark here. So, see, my might start raining a little harder. Hopefully, we're good. But yeah, keep an eye on those little details on the trail so you can make sure that you're going the right way. And if not, just always turn around and just double check and try to find the next, the last trailblaze you went. Whenever you feel you haven't seen one in a while. And just try to stay on the trail as much as possible. Unless you need to use the restroom. So guys, I'm at the top, it's cloudy, but it is is amazing up here. Uh, wow. So guys, um, I don't know if my camera is a little foggy or wet, because the lens might be wet a little bit, I'm trying to dry it, but it keeps getting wet. Um, it's pretty technical up here. Um, I'm actually, I just left uh, the pulpit rock so now I'm just kind of you got to keep scrambling through here um, these are pretty big rocks and stuff um, but it's it, it was definitely a beautiful view and I could just imagine if the sky was a sunny clear day but either or it was definitely worth coming up here hi guys I'm still kind of like now scrambling down it's taking me some time here just because all the scrambling I have to do. Um, but other than that, it's pretty it's pretty chill right now. It's actually peaceful up here, quite quiet. Um, just descending down. I saw a couple heading down. Surprisingly, they didn't stop to look at the Vista, but I guess maybe they've been here often or so. <laughs> Unless they just, because I was there. Who knows? So this is the part where it's another little trail that kind of like connects. Can't remember what is it called. Um, but yeah, now continue through here. This is going to take us to the pinnacle. I'm not sure if that's the highest point. Now that's where we're heading. And then we'll continue to the AT. And then we eventually will turn back towards heading back to the car, making a, a nice little loop. So been still technical um, and I actually got my foot or shoe stuck I had to take off my shoe to get my shoe out between the rocks so
so that was pretty fun so yeah I mean other than that it's pretty pretty good at first I used to be kind of nervous going hiking by myself but um, I just decided one day to just do it backpacking actually the black forest trail by yourself it's not at first is intimidating but as long as you just do your homework stay on the trail and you know make sure you keep it safe and not do anything stupid you should be fine um, so if you guys ever feel like you're questioning yourself if you should do it by yourself just do it and just do your homework because sometimes it's kind of hard to find um, you know people that hike do not go just because you know you can't find people that are willing to go with you look at all these rocks behind me all this rock scrambling see if you could there's just rocks everywhere walking along this ridge is pretty cool nice little views it hasn't been rainy for a little bit now um, so and the fog has gone a little bit so you can kind of see straight across the trees are blocking of course but um, it is it's really really cool up here video but this definitely is pretty cool to be up here. I've been up here for quite a bit now. So now we're on the supposedly pinnacle trail. Um but it's also the AT. I don't I guess that's what it is but um we're heading back I guess towards not necessarily towards the car but and somewhat I got to see how many miles I've done so far but I would guess is close to half I would say so yeah so guys I just checked the map and I'm about close to five miles in so I got probably another four a slightly over more than four but um yeah it's pretty good This is the first section up here that's been just pretty much flat, I guess. Not with all the rocks and stuff. There's these little things making noise. 
I don't know what they are. And if I get close, they stop making noise and they stop moving. So guys, got a little, my ears got cold a little bit wearing that cap. Um, right now, I think I'm just gonna drink some water, um, hydrate, and I got some um, trail mix that I'm gonna munch on while I start descending, cause we're pretty much only two miles from the car. So now we're gradually descending and approaching that area where we're going to rapidly descend. Um, and shortly after that we approach the car. So we're almost done. It's funny because this creek or lake, I didn't even notice it here when I first started the trail. <laughs> it's pretty crazy how I didn't even notice this. So guys, I completed the nine miles. Um, it was it was really really cool to see those vistas. Probably like the best ones I've seen so far, uh, especially the second one. Um, I think I could have definitely extended it. I got done quite early, but it's fine. So if you guys haven't subscribed, please subscribe and like and comment and let me know what you think of the vistas and if you did the trail what you think of it until next time